This is Valley News Live at 6. Thanks for joining us here at 6. We begin with new information in a Grand Forks murder case. Court documents filed today reveal a series of events that led up to the murder of Anthony Keel. Authorities have also determined the cause of death in this case to be blunt force trauma. Valley News Team's Harrison Prey joins us now live in studio with more. Harrison. That's right, Justin Stacy. Two men were arrested in the case last week, Donald Barlett and Nicholas Ride Arnold. Charges were filed today. Barlett was charged with murder and Ride Arnold with conspiracy to commit murder. At around 9 o'clock Thursday night, Grand Forks police responded to a 911 call from an apartment complex on Cherry Street. When police arrived, they found Keel with substantial trauma to his face. The apartment complex has multiple surveillance cameras where they were able to see Barlett and Ride Arnold coming and going from the victim's apartment. According to court records, Bartlett was seen leaving the victim's apartment just before 7 o'clock. Video surveillance shows him with his blood on his hand. About 20 minutes later, Bartlett returns and Nicholas Ride Arnold sh also shows up. The pair leaves around 7.30. Bartlett allegedly told a witness that a guy on the first floor came at him with a knife, so he had to beat him up. A search warrant of Anthony Keel's apartment turned up a 5-inch knife with, a, with blood on it and wooden coffee table legs broken off with blood on them. Preliminary autopsy results also show Keel had cuts on his neck, chest, and abdomen. Barlett was questioned by police and claimed self-defense, saying the victim attacked him first. He refused to go to court today, but another hearing is scheduled for tomorrow. We will continue to keep a close eye on what happens throughout the week. Justin, Stacy. Yeah, we'll see. Thanks so much, Harrison. And for the latest information on that murder case as it unfolds, download the VNL News app. All right.